Action News Now Storm Tracker weather. Coverage you can count on. Well, it's definitely a, a different feeling kind of day, and, and it's mm. not that long ago. I mean, it was this week, Chris, early this week, that it was colder and a little bit rainy, and, yeah. and what a difference. I know, and it's springtime and fall as well. You get these crazy swings of temperatures mm -hmm. here, and looks like we're doing that here with the warm-up today, and then much cooler weather Saturday, and then a real big warm-up as we get into next week. So still Mother Nature trying to figure out what she wants to do here in this uh, transitional season of spring. High temperatures this afternoon are in. They are warm. Some of the warmest readings we've had so far in 2019. Middle 80s in the valley. That's, that's toasty stuff for April. In the mountains, also 80 in Mount Shasta City. That's what Ron had in Quincy as well. 81 the afternoon high temperature in Bernie today. And tomorrow, we're going to come real close to doing it again. Another very warm day. Pretty comfortable at 8 o'clock in the morning as you head out to work. 62 at that time. Noon time, great time to you know, take your lunch outside. Maybe have lunch in the patio or something like that. And then by 5 o'clock, that was still pretty comfortable. 83 degrees under mostly sunny skies. We've also got the Red Bluff Roundup kicking off tomorrow and going through the big holiday weekend. Easter, of course, is Sunday. Friday evening, 7.30 when the rodeo uh, starts. Now 74 degrees in Red Bluff at that time. Saturday, uh, the rodeo starts at 2.30 in the afternoon, and that's going to be a cool one. High temperatures at that time, only in the middle 60s, and a few scattered showers, maybe even a thunderstorm. Sunday, Easter, dry, and temperatures at 1.30 in Red Bluff, about 70 degrees. So kind of a coolish Red Bluff roundup this year, it looks like. As far as what we have going on, pretty quiet across California. Watching this storm, we're tracking it very carefully. That's going to come on into California over the uh, weekend and really cool our temperatures down Saturday, but not tomorrow. Tomorrow looks like almost a repeat of today. High temperatures in the mountains in the 70s, very comfortable, so you still need the, uh, the T-shirts by the afternoon time. You may not have the sunglasses, though, because skies will turn partly cloudy by the afternoon. You need the sunglasses on the ridge. High temperatures, middle and upper 70s tomorrow, so another comfortable afternoon in our forecast here. In the north end of the valley, eventually those temperatures dipping down to the mid 50s. Tomorrow, you can open up the windows in the house, cool the house down in the morning, close them up by about noon or so, because in the afternoon it gets kind of warm with highs in the mid 80s. Same idea in the mid valley with clear skies tonight. Beautiful night for the Thursday night market in Chico. Tomorrow, close up those house windows yeah, around noon or so. High temperatures ending up in the middle 80s. Your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast for the weekend is always in view. Again, Good Friday will be warm, but Saturday, yeah, kind of cool, or at least uh, compared to today. Uh, low 70s for highs, scattered showers, maybe a thunderstorm. Easter Sunday will be dry, so good news for everybody going to Easter Sunday services or those Easter egg hunts. And temperatures warmer in the upper 70s. And the next week gets toasty. Reading's forecast also, maybe a little shower tomorrow evening, but still pretty comfortable during the day. Saturday, cooler, maybe a little wetter. Easter Sunday will be dry and temperatures in the upper 70s. Pretty nice for Easter. And then after that, boy, 90s potentially by Tuesday and Wednesday as it starts to really heat up. All right. Thanks, Chris. Mm -hmm. Well, time now for sports, and we're talking baseball and softball. Yeah, we are indeed. Uh, just ahead, the A's make sure.